you know, I really wanted, I, I just wanted to get into being a scratch DJ and I basically just went and learned how to do it in my bedroom, making grisly, horrible noises for about a, a year. And started the club called The Circus, which was sort of based around that kind of music. I mean, it's, again, a little bit before sampling had come out, so it was like electronic rap, hip hop, drum machines and all that stuff. It just travelled all over London. I think we started it and there was 200 people within a year. There was like two and a half thousand people. And that was like three times the size of any club that else was going on. It just grew massively really quickly. And in the end, I had a nightmare because I had these gangster people come down and, you know, there was huge money changing hands. I got ripped off and the police got involved and it was, it was a nightmare. It was really bad, awful. It kind of went tits up, big style. But it was quite amazing to build something that was yeah. obviously really taking off yeah. uh, very quickly and very easily, except I didn't have the infrastructure to deal with it, like the bar stuff. You know, and things like because we were taking over disused buildings and warehouses, and because it was too big for clubs, there was too many people coming. So, and it got very, very messy, and literally, I ended up being threatened, and that stopped me for a couple of years. After that, I just shut down, and the guys who were doing it went to prison and all this stuff. So it was kind of like really went tits up. But um, and then Acid House started.